So here, if we see that uh, if we want to install R in our Ubuntu Pop OS, then what we have to do, we have to go to this website and here they actually show you what you need to do. So even for installing R Studio, first you have to do that. You have to install the R itself first because R Studio runs the R and then you install the R Studio. So if you click in here, it will take you to this link where you will see. So actually, let's do it again. Download installer. So if you click it in here, you will see it takes you in this page. And as you want to download the R and install it for the Linux, uh, and we are specifically talking about the Ubuntu 22. So if you click in here, so there are basically you have to run basically these four instructions. The first two is just um, updating and then installing the record property and then the next two is for adding the repository. And then you install the R base and you can test the R base if the R is installed properly because we are installing the R 4.2 and some version of it. So we can actually check it from the terminal where you can see so how can you run this and access this? So for accessing this, you actually have to run this command, sudo ir, and then it actually shows you the version of R that is installed. And then I run a few commands to check if the R is installed properly, and then I have been encountered with the craft. And then what I did, uh, I this is the first part. And then what you have to do, you have to go there and download the R Studio for yourself. So you can see that for Ubuntu 22 and later, you have already a file. You download it and install it. It's basically pretty easy. It's almost like just click, click. And then what you have to do, and you can also install this dev file in another process via terminal also. So after installing it, you have the R, you have the R Studio. Now you just need to find the R Studio in your menus and you just run it. So I run it and with the simple file and here is my R. And this is the, uh, this is the result of me running the scripts and through the plots I haven't counted at this point. So it's uh, basically pretty easy. It's not something you have to be scared of and, and not something very troublesome. So that's all and that's how we can install our